And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And gearing up for this pulsating Liga Portugal match, it's Benfica, and they take on Vitoria Guimarães. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And this is how the starting 11 looks for Benfica. Joao Mario starts with Davi Neres out wide. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, when you see it like that, their central midfield players look a little bit isolated. But I'm expecting the two fullbacks to push up to make it more of a 3 4 3. And I think we see a lot of positional rotation in this starting 11. Muito obrigado, Estádio da Luz, e desfrutem do jogo. And the contest begins. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Florentino. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Well, on paper, this ought to be a mismatch. The home team with the best defence in the league. Their opponents who really struggle to find the net. How will this be on grass? Well, I have to say, they've been far too cautious in their... And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Rafa. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Rafa. It's with David Neres. A chance to whip it in. Well, it's one pass after another. And just like that, they don't have the ball anymore. Thiago Silva. And the cross didn't beat the first man. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. Joao Mario. And return to Gedge. Opportunity it is. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, here's the replay. And just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is.
And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Anderson Oliveira. And they've given him too much space. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Well, those stats tell you everything. Benfica have enjoyed the majority of the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Andre, Andre. Well, visionary passing. Well, it looked as though he might be on to something, but his timing left a bit to be desired. Yeah, that's frustrating, because he's just been too impatient there. He doesn't need to make his movement quite so early. Moving forward effectively. Gets! Oh, blocked it! Pressing high to win the ball. Can they convert? And fine goalkeeping. And over comes the corner. Well, the danger is still there. Rosano Gaddish. Oh, could be. And it goes. Well, it's one goal after another. A highly impressive performance. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And what a good finish this is. He just guides that beyond the keeper. A very tidy goal. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Has the strength to hang on to it. Thiago Silva. What a shocking pass, really. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. So a personnel change then. So that will do it for the first half. And the visitors know they're going to have to up their game in the second, Stuart. Well, as we've talked about, they struggle scoring goals. So it's going to be really difficult for them to get back into this. And so the second half is underway. They took quite the thrashing in that first 45. Can they turn things around now? Grimaldo. Gonzalo Gerdes now. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, transfer speculation is all part of football and there's been quite a lot of speculation on this front, but the deal has now been confirmed, Stuart. Well, he's a great talent. Hopefully this move will see him play at his best week in, week out. It's a really good move for everybody. Real chance. Can they put it away? Brilliantly blocked. That's really good and effective physical play. Andre, Andre. Thiago Silva. And here's Andre, Andre. Wanted to keep it but couldn't. 
and into the last 30 minutes now. Grimaldo. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Rafa. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Substitution time it is here. survived the attack well the counter chance looks very real poor pass Joao Mario on to Gedge and in possession Chiquinho just the challenge that was required He continues his run. Oh, he's lost possession. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? And they're making a change. Who can he pick out? Just too much height on that one. Close shave, though. Florentino. And he's won the ball. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Rafa. Oh, big opportunity. And thumped away. Given away by Benfica. Just ten minutes to go. Chiquinho. Raxler now. Rafa. And he's broken free. And the ball is loose. Threat over for now, it seems. Ogawa. Read it superbly to take back possession. Rafa. And here's Joao Mario. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Defenders need to cover. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Rafa. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, we spoke about their great defensive record, but today it was all about their front players. I thought they were excellent. Their ability to turn with the ball around the edge of the box was a real feature of their play. They were certainly good value for that win.